Now, next up is an impressionist whose audition featured a few things that have never been seen on TV before. The main one being Declan Donnelly making an audience laugh. <laughs> He's done a good impression of you. I love these impressions of you. I suppose you right? think you're quite witty, do you? Do you yes, think I you're do. quite witty? Careful, or you'll be doing an impression of a man who's in fighting jokes funny. <laughs> but you'll smash your face. <laughs> it's Darren Altman. My name's Darren Altman. I'm 43. I'm a voiceover artist, but tonight I'm going to be doing some celebrity impressions. I live in southwest London with my wife, Emma, and my two little girls. They're amazing. When I was a boy, I was always doing impressions. The chicken needs to go in the pan, yeah. Come on, big boy. As a voiceover artist, I get paid for doing it. Now to do your Declan Donnelly. First audition was well outside my comfort zone. I don't go on stage and entertain people. And you have to pinch yourself and go, did that just happen? Since that first audition, I think I've gone a little bit mad just practicing. If you'd have said B, you wouldn't be sitting here with £10,000. I just want to get it right for the semi-final. Darren's a fantastic father. The girls love being with him. We are so proud and we can't wait to see him tonight. Tonight's performance is huge for me. I really want to do well and get on that stage at the Royal Variety performance. <laughs> Welcome to From Celebrity Restaurant Kale! <laughs> oh, I'll tell it myself. Wow, look at that lady. She's got lovely bangers and mash. <laughs> <laughs> right, let me introduce Dick, our nature, Jordy. Tell us what's on the menu, but be nice and short. Nice and short. That's me, Gary, <laughs> on camera too. Still loving it. Well, I'm too busy being utterly adorable to work in a restaurant, ladies and gentlemen. But luckily, I know someone who'll do it. So if I take a step to my right, put some gravel in the throat, and a lovely big forehead, <laughs> I'll just run through the specials. Philly is still drizzled in a red wine and balsamic jus. Portland crab nestled in a bed of lime and mango. <laughs> or a kangaroo's knackers. <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't, I don't, I don't want to wear it. Right, right, you had one task and you failed. Right, what I ordered was boiled potatoes, right? But these have been dipped in very, very hot fat until they've gone lovely and crispy. You're fried. <laughs> oh, no, just take another order from walking round the restaurant holding me microphone, pretending not to know where I'm going, <laughs> desperately trying to create suspense before I choose. You, sir, you look like you're enjoying your meal. <laughs> uh, and as we all know, a Michelin star restaurant is one of the world's most uh, unforgiving environments. And in this situation, it's important to take protein on board. Uh, so what I'm going to do uh, is I'm going to have a dead squirrel and a glass of my own pee. <laughs> hey, big boy, hey, look at me. Yes, hey, hey, where's the scallops? Come on! <laughs> to create um, and serve successful scallops, one has to um, Slice, saute, and sear them sensitively so they stay succulent in the center. But, um, sadly, the uh, waiter has stupidly slipped and spilt them. Oi, oi, McPartland, eh? Get over here, yes? You're about to have a kitchen nightmare. Oh, no! Rams is on the rampage! Get me out! Thank you, thank you. Uh, Simon, let's start with you. Oh, thank you. D uh, I like you. I loved your audition. The actual performance you did tonight within the restaurant was terrible. Oh. Uh, it just, it, I didn't know who half the people were because you were running around so much. I don't know who Fried is or, or the P one. I, I have to know who these people are. Um, who? It was Bear Grylls. Bear Grylls. Sorry. Um, I think it would have worked better if, I, if we could go back in time. It would have been you on the stage doing what you do best. 
Because right. I think you were overthinking it. Okay. 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 Deal. The impressions were fantastic, and you are brilliantly talented at doing that. I think the nice way of saying what Simon just said is you don't need all of that. Yes. You no. know, the great thing about impressions is you can be hundreds of different people, so you just need to stand on the stage in the spotlight and do those impressions. But the impressions, impre <laughs> the impressions were fantastic, and I love seeing impressions of these two. Yes. <laughs> I love that too. And your Gordon Ramsay is brilliant. Um, I like you a lot, and I think David's right. I think you, you, you on your own is good enough, right. and I hope the public get behind you, because okay. I think there's so much potential in you. Thank you so much. and no orchestras, it is just you. And I actually applaud you for taking on some impressions that we might not necessarily think of as being done. I'm sorry that Simon didn't get some you of them. I think people are. at home probably did. I knew who Anne was. Yeah, we all know who Ant is. He stands in there. <laughs> <laughs> so, overall, I, I want to... I wanna... I want to praise you, because I think you did a really good job. It's difficult, but you Thank did you. a good job. Well, 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 well and uh, I think as well, I think... I think you guys know who Ant is because it was a very good impression. The other one of me wasn't so good. In fact, in fact, uh, yeah, you, well, you can stand here next to Darren, then you okay. just you'd be me and then read those numbers there. Go on. Go on. If Darren is your winner, call <laughs> 09020 4424 from a landline from your mobile call 644 or vote via the app. But remember, you can't vote until the last act is performed. That's it. One more time, me! Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>